there's no need to worry about traveling with your baby. Because we're gonna round up all of these products and give you our tips and tricks about traveling with your baby. Whether you're traveling by plane or car, it is great to travel with a travel system. So a travel system is basically a stroller and a car seat that go together. Here we have the Graco Tempo travel system. You can just pop on the car seat onto this stroller and it clicks pretty easily. This is also nice because it falls within the Disney guidelines. And this system we recommend for a newborn, but it's great to have a lightweight stroller also when you have a toddler or an older child to get through the airport or long traveling days. And speaking of strollers, next up we have the Skip Hop Stroller Fan. Whenever you are going to places like Disney World or Six Flags and it's super hot outside, this is a fan that you can put right on the stroller. Definitely something you should just keep in your car, keep in your stroller, just to have it on hand because when you need it, you really need it. It's rechargeable, yeah. so you don't have to worry about batteries. It can run up to six hours and it's bladeless. So my baby, Remy, she loves to stick her hands in the blades. Luckily, I have a foam one, okay? <laughs> but she just plays with the fan like all the time. This is great. I think I'm gonna use this. Baby's under control now, so now we start packing. So we have this diaper bag <laughs> from Product of the North. With traveling and just anything, you want your hands free when you have your baby. So a backpack diaper bag is much better on your body, for your baby, for everyone when you're traveling or when you're on the go with a baby. I like that it's large. It seems very durable, washable, because you know things get kind of gross after traveling. It also comes with a handy dandy changing, changing pad. pad. Bottle of water, you can put two of these here too, because that's like very important also. The design of this is really like gender neutral. Oh, like yeah. my diaper bags are all kind of girly, so I think this would be nice to travel for the dads. To no, I mean, this is nice because you don't know if it's a diaper bag or if you don't know if I'm just, you know, going yeah. to hang out with the fellas for a weekend in Vegas, yeah. even though I'm not. Speaking of which, there is a pocket for your laptop as yeah. well. Yeah, and everything you can just wipe down in here. I love the yeah. inside of this bag too, because I can tell you my diaper bag at home does not wipe down that yeah, easy. Yeah. So I like the inside of this as well. If you're flying with a baby or with kiddos, don't worry, you're allowed to bring breast milk, formula, juice, and food, as long as it's in a pouch and in reasonable quantities. So it can be over the three ounce limit, but double check TSA guidelines as well. So we've got the Skip Pop storage system and we have the Kind Foodie Starter Kit. It comes with 10 reusable pouches and then it comes with this bottle, which is nice because it attaches right to the pouch so you don't have to worry about spills. There's also multiple attachments for the pouch that it comes with. So you have smaller attachments for maybe more liquidy items that you're worried about spilling or thicker foods. So you have a few options. And my favorite part, it comes with a spoon attachment that has a hole. So you can give them the pouch, but they have the benefit of like eating with a spoon still. And I love this Skip Pop storage system because you can break this up in three and I have three kids. So honestly, here's some goldfish for you, Sersha. Here's this for you, Major. And then for Mayhem, it's just like right here, we have this powder thing where it's just like you can actually put the formula into the bottle and then they all just go right back together. And these bottom ones, they're also watertight. So you can put juice or milk or whatever you want in these as well. Now we have the Little Baby All Seasons Carrier. And I mean, carriers are very important. I love traveling. a good carrier, oh yes. my gosh. Nothing is more key than having your hands free while you're traveling, especially when you're in the airport. You know, you need to get your booking ticket, you need to have your luggage, you have your carry-on, you have your diaper bag. But oh, where's baby? Yeah. On you. The nice part about this carrier is there's up to six ways to wear it. Up to 45 pounds as well. I love wearing carriers because babies are heavy and the nice part is this eases the pain on your body, right? So you can wear them on your back, you can wear them on your front facing out so they can see the world facing you so they can rest. This is what I love the most, especially, I mean, I use it as a sunshade also. This is for a rain cover, but you can just snap it up here and then baby's nice and secure in there. There's still room to breathe. There's no rain, no sunshine getting on their little faces. <laughs> You can go to the restroom with this thing as well. Your baby's right here, safe. And if you need to get like your ID out, you need to get a credit card out, right here. 
It's so, perfect. Like one time we left this when traveling and we had to buy one as soon as we got to the next place. So you need this when you travel. Don't forget it, otherwise you'll be buying one. All right, so we moved our table over to show you this awesome product. It is a portable baby high chair by Ingelsina. And it's a great price point at $80 and it holds a baby up to 37 pounds. It's super compact. It comes in this nice bag that stays attached so you don't lose it. And it attaches to any table surface. Yeah, and it's perfect for any restaurant, any place you're gonna go. So our kids can, you know, sit there and eat at the table with the rest of us. And it's not like them sitting on the floor or something like that. Yeah. Or on your lap, yeah. which I just realized going to a restaurant for the first time. And I was trying to enjoy my food thinking I still have a newborn that would just sleep through the meal but I was wrong and I needed this desperately. This might be the most versatile thing that you'll take when you travel with your baby in whatever way, and that is the Aiden and I swaddle blanket. You can use these for like a million different things. A million. Yeah. Burp cloth, blanket, sunshade. Not to mention how many times have you been out in public and you forgot your changing pad? Oh. That's when these come in handy. I have a million of these just around my shoulder, diaper bag everywhere. And when I need it, especially when I'm at the changing pad, I'm like, oh no, I don't have one. I just throw this down and we can wash it super easy. Oh yeah. And it's perfect to swaddle. Of course, we got to remember, yeah. we can use it for a million different things, but the thing that it's really used for is to swaddle your baby so your baby can get some sleep. All right. So our next item is definitely underrated. It's a baby travel crib. This one is by Baby Bjorn. Yeah. And this is a must when traveling as well. I know I've been saying that a lot, but this is a must when traveling because it's always good for your baby to have a safe place to sleep. That's where this comes into play because a lot of hotels, they will have pack and plays, but like your parents might not have one or they'll have to go out and buy one and it'll be a whole thing because somebody forgets, you know how that goes. And like Airbnbs too, like they, all of them, they don't have them either, you know? So you wanna make sure that you have this and you can put this like right in your suitcase. Like that's how small and compact this thing is. Also, this one is super easy. You literally just open it up and it's set up. So it's not like a ton of pieces. It's not stressful. It breaks down really easy. It comes with a nice bag that is pretty compact too. So you can just pack it for your travels. This is the On The Go Baby Dome by Fisher Price. So this is a safe place for your babies that are newborn up to six months to sleep safely in, especially on the go when you're traveling, when you're flying. This folds up and it's super compact and easy to take along with you. The nice part about this is it comes with a little, a little bed and sheets that you can remove and wash, which is a nice addition, as well as a little mobile or toy area for babies to play with as they're winding down. And you can fold this up right here, give baby a little bit of shade, so then baby can, you know, take a nice nap in here as well. Baby can sleep in here. This is the ultimate baby hack, and it's a sound machine called the Baby Shisher, the sleep miracle. This is nice to just drown out the noise and make baby feel comfortable, like if they've heard this sound back at home. This is a nice, uh, nice comfort tool. So as you can hear. It's literally someone shushing. Someone shushing, you turn it on, you have a timer. So we have 15 and 30, so a little timer for it on and then the volume's at the bottom. Just turn it down, just turn it back up. And I love how small this thing is because like you can put this literally anywhere. You can throw this right into your diaper bag. You can throw this right into your purse. Those are some awesome items that you should take when traveling. Kayla, is there anything that you're gonna take with you? Yes. Yeah. So our first time traveling, I'm definitely taking the portable high chair. Oh, gotta take it. I mean, I want all of it, but the portable high chair is a must have. <laughs> <laughs> definitely a must have. So what do you think? Let us know and um, we'll see you next time.